Two teens and a toddler are recovering from gunshot wounds this morning after a shooting that left bullets strewn about two blocks in North Philadelphia. CBS News Philadelphia's reporter Kim Hudson joins us live in our newsroom. She's got the latest on this investigation. Kim, good morning. Good morning, Natasha. They're saying that they are very lucky that all the victims are in stable condition, according to police. Take a look at Chopper 3 over a chaotic scene last night. Police shut down streets on and around North 11th Street near the Philadelphia Housing Authority. Philadelphia officers and Housing Authority officers rushed to the area after several 911 calls reported gunfire just after 8.30. Police say they found a two-year-old boy and a 15-year-old girl shot in their legs in front of their house. Philadelphia Police Chief Inspector Scott Small says those children were rushed to Temple University Hospital, but soon police realized there was another victim. Minutes after we arrived on location and were investigating the scene, we were notified that a 17-year-old victim showed up at Jefferson Hospital with a gunshot wound to his ankle. That 17-year-old was able to tell police that he was also shot in the area here of 11th and Master Streets. Small says investigators tracked more than 30 shell casings over two blocks. He says those casings were from at least two different guns. Police also say there is surveillance video showing someone getting out of a white SUV with tinted windows and opening fire. Police are looking for that car. Police do not believe the two-year-old or the 15-year-old were intended targets. They are not sure if the 17-year-old was targeted. Natasha. All right, Kim, thank you very much for that update.